Hello guys, welcome to Violet Adazet. Violet here and today we are looking at another Madonna video into the groove official video. I've heard the song before, the get into the groove. <laughs> <laughs> but I have never watched the music video. I was reading up on it on Wikipedia and what I found out about it is it was released in 1985 for Desperately Seeking Susan, which is a 1985 film. Before we get started, I would like to give a big shout out to Quanta Vichy. Quanta Vichy's smart heated gloves and socks are the first ever wearables that sense and maintain the exact temperature you set and come in a very thin, breathable and stylish design that allows you to still have precision with whatever it is you are doing. They can heat up to 130 degrees Fahrenheit or 50 degrees Celsius and come with an app that lets you choose the exact temperature you prefer. In addition to the smart heating features, the socks also offers compression ribbon, arch support, mesh for ventilation, and even anti-blister and shock absorption cushions. This dynamic duo are great for anyone like me who needs their hands and feet to be warm and snug at all times during cold weather, and they will also make a unique and thoughtful gift to someone. Quanta Vichy currently has a limited time holiday sale going on right now, so use the link in my description box below to get your heated gloves and socks while supplies last. So with that being said, guys, it is time to look at Get Into The Groove. Let's get into the groove. That's a cool jacket. Ooh, remember when Illuminati was huge? There was a time when people just kept going on about Illuminati, Illuminati. Spot the Illuminati symbolism in music videos. If this came out during that time, oh, people would have gone wild. This whole music video so far, I know they're cutting it in between a music video and clips from the movie, I believe. Oh, it's giving me nostalgia that I shouldn't even have because I wasn't born in the 80s, but I still have the nostalgia. To me. Okay, booty. I love her hair like that so much. It looks so nice. Okay, one thing I am getting confused with because I haven't seen the movie. It's kind of hard to tell which ones are clips from the movies and which ones are clips from the music video because I've not seen neither of them. It's, it intertwines really well, so that's why it's so hard. If you know, let me know. Your love to me. Oh, hell yes. Is that a table that has a built in tray for snacks? That is a Netflix and chill dream. Like, see, that was like a movie to me. Oh, that is a movie. I'm liking how she's having clips within the clip. For example, how she just brought up that Polaroid picture and it has a scene in the Polaroid picture. That's really cool. So this part right here, is this a movie? Is this a movie clip or is this a music video? I know when I watch this back and I get the comments and I get a better idea of what's going on, I'm probably gonna feel very, very silly because I really cannot tell. The only reason I ask is because on Wikipedia, it said that there are clips of the film in the music video, but it didn't say all of it was clips from the film. So it's kind of confusing if all the clips I'm seeing right now are from the film, if it's only partially, and if it's only partial, then which part is the music video? I'm lost in the sauce in case you can't tell. Wait, wait, that is ingenious. Can all public bathroom blow dryers do that? I'm loving her iconic Madonna 80s style here too. She looks gorgeous. Based on all the Madonna hairstyles I've seen, this is probably my favorite hairstyle like this and maybe how her hair looked in Material Girl and the hair color. All this 
fade ins and fade outs. This is the most 80s thing I've ever seen in my life. And why do they keep showing that flash, that photo flash? See, this is the thing about this kind of stuff that is made for a movie. There's so much things out of context for me. I'll have to watch the movie to really get the context, right? You love to me. What had happened? They are showing a lot of clips right now. I'm convinced this whole video are just clips from the actual film. I think that's what it is. I don't see her lip syncing at all. It seems like things are happening that are very out of context that it won't make sense for it to be the music video. So correct me if I'm wrong, but I think all the clips are from movie. That is a phone right there, if I've ever seen the phone. That was obviously an amazing song. The song is iconic. I love how Madonna looks. I love her hair. I love her 80s style in general. And I feel like those kind of looks are kind of coming back. Like, I feel like Gen Z is kind of like 80s, 90s kind of vibes. This music video, it just needs to be remastered. Throw it into the new age and it'll fit right in with Gen Z. So with that being said, I want to see what people are saying about this music video. This song is like a great memory of somewhere you've never been. What have I been saying this whole video? It gives me nostalgia. It's just a feel-good feeling. You know what it reminds me of? If you are a Black Mirror fan by any chance, or if you've seen Black Mirror, if you haven't, by the way, go watch it. It's amazing. It's on Netflix. It reminds me of the episode San Junipero. Go watch that episode and let me know if it doesn't give you kind of the same vibe. This song has the best synth sequence ever. This groove is an all-time great. I don't know enough about synth sequences. <laughs> I'm just going to agree with you on that one. <laughs> Into the Groove, by far my favorite Madonna song. Wow. I never understood why it wasn't as popular as like a version or Material Girl, etc. I think it's the song with the best groove by far of all her songs. It makes you want to dance nonstop. I love the song, but I do like Material Girl better and I like Vogue better. Top seven, maybe? Maybe. Maybe. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. It really, 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 really helps me out with the YouTube algorithm. Comment down below your thoughts. Help me understand this music video. Let me know your favorite Madonna music video of all time because I might want to check it out if I haven't already. Also, if you haven't already, consider subscribing to my channel and clicking that notification bell for more videos coming your way. Videos like this, like this, like this, like this, and more. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.